What's up everybody, welcome back to another video. Today, I wanna to make a quick little sporical video. I've been wanting to make one of these for a while now, but I wanna be sure to include my face in it because I know a lot of NBA YouTubers or a lot of NBA commentary channels or sports commentary channels in general, they can be pretty boring because they're just looking at a blank screen with a guy talking in the background and it's like, hey guys, welcome back to another video. And today I'm gonna to be talking about how, how, how the NBA went bad and how, 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 how. And it can be pretty boring, especially when you don't have a face to associate with the video. I know it can be boring. So that's why I wanna make a couple videos every now and then where I have my actual face in the video and where you see me ranting and you see a little bit of personality because I know the videos where it's just like, hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're gonna be talking about how the NBA and all how, how. And then you're just watching highlights the whole video. I know it could be boring. So that's why I'm gonna do these every now and then just so you guys can get a little bit of personality out of me and so that it's not like dead boring sometimes. Oh, hey, I figured I'm a pretty funny person. Well, I hope I am. I hope I don't sound pretty stupid. We're gonna try this sporical quiz. I would like to say I'm pretty knowledgeable when it comes to the game of basketball, but it can be pretty difficult if we're talking 60s through 50s. I wasn't alive, anywhere near alive. My parents weren't even alive and people were still doing crack. Well, <laughs> they're still doing it to this day. So this is gonna be a pretty difficult quiz at the end for me. That's why I'm doing it. I'm doing a little bit of a challenge on myself in hopes that I can figure out who the nowadays superstars are, the ones that won championships and who the plumbers Michael Jordan played against and who the crackheads from the 50s were. So I'm hoping I can do this and I'm hoping I can get them all right because it's gonna be a little bit difficult for me. Start off with Middleton obviously, or Giannis, Lakers, LeBron, right, dude, look at all the LeBron ones, <laughs> yeah, wait till we put Curry, uh, Raptors, Leonard, hopefully that gives me two of them, yep, um, Tim Duncan, uh, the Mavericks, ooh, JJ Barea, oh, spelled that wrong, duh, I gotta do that for my Ricans, for my people, Lakers, Bryant, R.I.P. Kobe, Man, okay, so for the Lakers, we could do Shaq. Wait, I already put all the Laker ones. We'll just put Wade. Hell yeah, we'll put Dwayne Wade. Celtics, we'll put Ray Allen. <laughs> Pistons, we'll put Darko Milicic, because that's like one of the greatest Pistons of all time. Um, For the Bulls, 1998. Huh. Hmm, Bulls Dynasty. Oh, Tony Kukoc, duh. Um, hey, get this... Yo, 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 get this ad out of my face. All right. For the Rockets, Kenny the Jet Smith. Because, oh, I guess we'll put Elijah one. Oh. <laughs> I spelled that really bad. All right, and now we're going to keep going with the Bulls. Uh, We'll put Joe Dumars for the, you know, hey. Hey, I'm, try I'm trying to show you guys I know a little bit more than just the average typical superstars. I'm going to know a couple plumbers like, um, like that one plumber, Larry Bird. Yeah, that guy. See, I know what I'm talking about. Now we're going to talk about Magic Johnson. There's a lot to say. Um, the Bulls. Huh, who was on that Bulls squad? Oh, man. Horace Grant. Obviously. Who the heck is Michael Jordan? All right, 1983 Sixers. Huh. Look, this, this is what I've learned. When you do these quizzes, you just got to type in, like, the most cliche, typical names. And a lot of times they pop up. Let's try to put Robert Pitt. Oh, oh. He's already there. Oh, well, at least we got Bill Walton for the Trailblazers. Celtics Warriors. Oh, what was that one guy on the Warriors? Oh, he was he was so popular. Oh, and the Lakers. Who was the Lakers GM? Um, The little white guy, the little Jerry West. He's not even little. Oh, that's how you, oh, oh, we got Chamberlain. Even though he didn't really win that many. Um, Let's see. Sixers. Oh, Dr. J, Julius Irving. Come on. Oh. Irving. <laughs> um, we could put Malone. Nope. For the bullets. Oh, I was the guy. Um his West Unseld. Yep. Um 76 Celtics. You guys ready for me to get them all right? Watch this, watch this. Bill. Russell. <laughs> Damn, that is a lot. My man just filled up almost the whole board. Now, when it comes to the Laker ones and the Royals, I don't remember because all I remember was that guy with the little glasses that's always in 2K that people love, Bob Pettit. Is it Pettit? I, I have no idea what the guy's name is. Oh, see, look, I got it right. But it was for the Hawks. Okay. Well, that's kind of awkward. 
the Knicks, 97. Oh, the guy that does the Knicks broadcasting. What's his name? Um, oh, man, he's such a he's such a good broadcaster, too. I really enjoy watching Knicks games just because of him. His name. Oh, man, what was his name? Bill Clyde, right? I spelled... No, it's... Oh, well, hey, I do remember Walt Frazier. That's one of them. So the Celtics, Warriors. The Warriors was a very specific guy. I remember when I watched the Warriors win the championship in 2015, they showed shorts of this guy winning the championship. Oh, what was his name? What was his name? I, I knew this last part was going to kill me. Oh, well, for the Bucks, I could put um a lot. Uh, not a lot. A lot of, I could put Abdul Jabbar. Oh, I put it wrong. Abdul Jabbar. So there we go. We got Abdul Jabbar. Huh. Celtics. I mean, I already put Bird. So. Um, maybe I could try this guy. The, the GM of the Lakers that just retired. What was his name? Man, I already forgot. Jer no, what the hell? Huh. Let's just type in random names that we already see. Even though that's not really going to help. Um, dude, this is really hard. I knew this was going to be difficult coming into it, but I didn't... I, I, man, this is... And I'm stuttering a little bit. That's how you can tell I'm a little bit nervous and I'm a little bit worked up. This, this is difficult. Okay. You guys are probably in the comments spamming me. Or there's probably no comments because I only got like one or two per video. But like, man, Celtics 1976. Let me look at my wall and see if there's any hints. No, there's no hints. You might be wondering why I sped the video up. I literally could not guess the last group of people. And if I left the video as it was, you were going to watch six minutes of me just going, uh, uh, uh. Uh, so I had to speed it up just so that you want to be super boring <laughs> because it was mad boring. So I guess I'm going to just end it there because I'm not going to get it. And then once I see who they are, man, I'm... let's just do it. Once I see who they are, I'm going to feel so stupid. Watch. Here we go. I'm going to do it at two. I'm going to do it at two. And the results are... Joe White, Rick Barry was it? Oh my gosh, I had it in my head. And George Mi Mi Mikan, George Mikan, I knew who he was. That was the 2K card I was talking about. They give him out every year in 2K for some reason. And I don't know, maybe the guy was a beast back in the day, but I was never going to get that. These last ones were pretty hard. I do know who Rick Barry was. Rick Barry was the white guy I was talking about, but I couldn't get it. I couldn't get his name right. I couldn't think about who he was. And then I tried guessing names, and none of these guys had anywhere near those names. Maybe I could have gotten Joe White. I don't really know, but hey, I tried. What what was my percentage? I got a nine, I got an eighty six percent. In all honesty, for my first quiz on such a difficult subject, I'm gonna give myself a pat on the back for that. I I'm pretty proud of myself. I got over an eighty. I got over an eighty five, which is exactly what I was aiming for. In all honesty, for my first quiz. On such a difficult subject, I'm going to give myself a pat on the back for that. I, I'm i pretty proud of myself. I got over an 85, which is exactly what I was aiming for. So I'm really proud of myself for that. And I'm going to give myself the W on that one. I just have to. So for my first one, I got an 86. Hopefully for my next one, I'll do a little bit better. And it's not just me trying to think about the next guy when clearly I don't know who it is. That's all I'm going to do, guys. Make sure to stick around for another one. I'll be posting another one every now and then. I really do enjoy doing these, and I find it fun, especially just thinking about who is next on the list, and I can never figure it out sometimes. So hopefully next time I do a lot better than today. Hopefully next time I can get 100. I, I prefer doing the historic ones because they're so difficult. So thank you guys so much for watching. I truly appreciate all the love and support. Make sure to like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to hit the bell next to my name so you can get notified every time I upload. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm out. Peace.